Mikhail, Jeremy, ACC Network. What Saturday night mean to you? Uh, well, first of all, just like it's overwhelming just to get a chance to get back out there and play with my teammates and uh, get a chance to play against another team. We've been hitting on each other all since uh, since the summer and uh, just going against each other. So it's it's good for us to get out there and um, actually play against a different team. And we're ready on both sides of the ball. <clears throat> Okay, Fox Brown, Kentucky today. What what do you expect out of this year's offense? It was pretty good last year. I mean, well, if we go out, like Coach always say, if we go out and execute uh, everybody's assignment, everybody does, uh, Dr. T's and across the I's, I mean, we'll be fine. And um, just executing, that's the biggest thing we've been uh, harping on and just going fast and trying to get better at the things that we uh, didn't do good last year. I feel like we've been doing a good job this whole summer, uh, this whole core team up to this time uh, of doing that. So uh, we're ready. <clears throat> Mikhail, hey, it's Jody Dumbling with CardinalAuthority.com. It has, what was Sunday and today like knowing that it's game week and you're out there preparing and, and that you actually have a game to play this week? What's the, what's the mood been like? Um, it's been it's been crazy. Like the air, all the players are up and happy. Like I mean, we're ready to go. Like if the game was like what's what's time is it six or two hours, we'll be ready. Hey, Mikhail Cameron from the Courage Journal. Um, a guy who's going to make his pro- probably make his first start, Justin Marshall. Um, just kind of what have you seen from Justin throughout the off season this summer? Um, kind of how much have you seen him improve uh, over the course of that that time? Um, it's, uh, it's, it's good to see uh, Justin out there. I mean, if we came in together like in the same class and um, pictured, pictured us playing together uh, ever since freshman year, and, and he finally get his chance to uh, show what he can do uh, this season. So uh, I'm pumped for him. I'm, I'm really, uh, really excited for him to get out there and see what he's going to do. And um, I know he's excited and he's ready to play and, and, and show you guys that uh, he's, a, he's a good receiver. <clears throat> what do you think he brings to that receiving core? Uh, the physicality part, he's probably the most physical receiver. And, like, it's just DBs, they just, it's hard for them to, like, stay in front of him because he's so strong and on, like, a lot of outbreaking routes, he just swim by and just, just his strength. And um, he's good uh, with, uh, like, uh, contested catches. He's good at that. Okay, I'll Russ Brown again. Where, where have you made the biggest improvement, you think, from the bowl game, you know, the end of last season to now? Um, just just knowing the ins and outs, like the like the whole offense, just trying my best to like just like learn everything, you know, just take the game to another level. Like as a quarterback position, you can't dwell on on last season and what you did in the bowl game. All oh, that's out the window. Like nobody's nobody's gonna um remember that. And now we get a chance to play Saturday, and I just got to show how much I've improved on my accuracy and uh, just good decision making. And at the quarterback position, um, you gotta be more. I gotta be more of a vocal leader, and that's what I've been working on this whole time. And um. I feel like I've done a good job up until this point, and uh, I'm ready to showcase it. Mikhail, hey, it's Jody again. What what is a lot of, has been made of the early games, and and no crowds or little crowds. The atmosphere is going to be totally different Saturday with only twelve thousand. How do you guys, as a team, kind of get yourself motivated for that? Coach was talking about that yesterday of of the motivation from inside the locker room. Um, well, Coach, Coach Mike talk about it all the time. We got to bring our own juice. Like we we'll need fans to bring juice. I mean, we would love that. It would be. It would help us on um, both sides of the ball. But us as players, we motivated ourselves. So it's uh, basically like self motivation. So all of us, um, we just take it like we just got to bring our own juice and um, and we just got to cheer each other on on the sideline. We're not in. We got to be dialed into the game. Offense turn on defense and defense turn on offense. So we can uh, execute and execute the game plan and uh, come out with a victory. Mikhail Cameron again. Some of the guys on the defensive side of the ball have said they've been very motivated um, this offseason to kind of build to improve, build off that bowl game and improve on last year. How have you seen, I was the guy who goes against them every day, how have you seen their motivation, their energy throughout uh, the offseason? Oh, uh, man, it's crazy. And, it, and, like, it's funny because, like, I'm so happy and ready, like, to see the defense. I don't know how – I don't know how much to explain it. Like, I just know the defense is, is going to be so much better. Like, they know where to go. They're much faster, uh, very strong. We got a lot of depth. And um, and in the secondary, I mean, I like those guys against anybody in the country. You line them up, and, and I like our guys over them. And um, it's just crazy like, to see that defense and how they flying around. And and with containing me, I, I'm, I feel like I'm a pretty good runner. And so – when you get other quarterbacks coming here and, and run, I feel like they haven't seen, not they haven't not seen that. So that's uh, that's good for them. And um, I'm just ready for to see those guys ball out for real, for real.
<laughs> yeah, what do you better Western's got a veteran group back on defense and Malone up front has caused a lot of havoc for teams last year. You all did a pretty good job against them, but it was early in the year. What what have you seen anything on film or kind of what do you what do you expect? What's coach been telling you to expect? Uh, well, I mean, they're very uh I mean very experienced. Uh they got uh ten starters coming back and um uh, starting off with him, uh I actually like know uh D'Angelo, so I kinda know him pretty well and um he's a very good kid and uh, we really gotta find out where he is. I think last year he had like ten tackles against us in uh in like a sack. So we definitely gotta find out where he is and they got a lot of experience and um like I said, we just uh, going to execute our game plan, and we'll have a good, uh, pretty good chance at a, a victory. All right. Anything else for Mikhail before we wrap up and move forward? Um, you guys. Or is our team?